So I've just checked into the Intercontinental in Da Nang and I thought I'd do a quick room review. So that's the front door. And as you come into the front area, you've got kind of like a study desk. Uh, you can see all the way through to the bedroom. TV out there. So starting off the right side, there's like a little mini bar. I've got some mini bottles there. I haven't checked in here yet. So there's there, uh, Coke, beers, you know, stuff. The, the food menu is really, really good as well. So there's a lot of options in terms of dining. And you come around, here's the toilet. It's a weird circular shape and some nice decorations. And then as you come out of the bathroom, you come into the uh, main bathroom area. So you've got huge windows out to the, uh, the ocean there and there's a, a rain shower, which weirdly, I haven't tried it yet because I've only just checked in. You can just, you know, just water goes on the floor. So that'd be interesting to use. And then you've got this huge stone bath. So it's massive, huge, slab here, some nice uh, decorations, so just look at the view, you can see the beach out there. So this is a terrace room, and uh, so it's got a balcony with a terrace, you can sit outside. In terms of mean teas, you've got very nice, so it's, it was uh, designed by Bill, Bill Bainsley, I always pronounce his surname incorrectly. You've got some great amenities and design features here. Uh, you've got you know, full toothpaste, you've got your razors, you know, your usual stuff, combs. There's a hairdryer in there. And you've got those beautiful lamps and decorations. Nice big mirror. So just behind the bathroom area, you can see into the bedroom. This bedroom then is also, you can see straight onto the balcony, so let me just open this up, if I can. There you go, straight onto the terrace area. So maybe some rain in the distance. So they have said that there are a lot of monkeys on resorts, so they said make sure you have to even lock the doors, uh, or the monkeys will, they know how to open the doors and they'll come in. So here's the desk area, got some fruit, like some activity guides. Got the luggage rack here and some covers. And then, got some great robes. And some, you know, great slippers, usual stuff like safe. You got the bags for the beach, you know, call it a Vietnamese hat iron, things like that. And the other side you've got, this is these are like these high up cupboards. I don't know what you use for those, but they've got storage space there. And then come round, so these open up. You can see the terrace there. And you've got the main bedroom area. It's a huge double bed with, uh, you've got like sockets down under the bed and all the usual kind of amenities, you know, there's you know, phones, remote controls. Uh, they've left a nice little flower there and got these beautiful ceilings, if I can go up there. There you go. It's really well designed. Um, and then turn around here, you've got like a little seating area. Drawers, DVD. This opens up again here, so in the morning you can open that up and look out to the ocean. You've got a nice water and everything. And then out onto the veranda. So this is where I'm just ordered my lunch. I've got huge chairs here. Definitely be having a Negroni later at sunset. Beach 
area, it's kind of all water sports. And then you've got this beautiful dining area, which is huge, it's like a, it's massive, it's like a very large surfboard or something. And then a little chair here. So overall, beautiful room, very airy, really well designed. Uh, the resort is huge. So uh, looking forward to exploring it. Looks like a great gym, great pools, and a great selection of bars and restaurants. I think there's something like, I think it's like 12 bars and restaurants. So anyway, thanks for watching. Any questions about the resort or the room, let me know in the comments.